Montague's message, November 22, 2015. There are so many factions, all vying for control in your world today, and you cannot trust any of them. You have unknowingly allowed this state of affairs to happen. You forget that each one of you is a sovereign being who is entitled to be on earth. You are conned by these interlopers, who persuaded you to hand over your power to them. Politics was their idea, as was religion and banking, all specially designed to make you servile to them. They have taken all that is rightfully yours. Now, each one of you must take back your consent from them. You must use your voice to do this, if possible, in groups, as this makes it more powerful. Without your consent, religions and politics cannot function. Politics and religion are only in place to control your lives. Each day they kill you a little more, through the air, water, food and medication. Sometimes they also use guns and bombs to create fear in you. What more do you need them to do to you, before you wake up and refuse to comply with them? What happened in Paris is but a small part of their overall game. Before you give credence to the latest boogeyman, remember Osama bin Laden. They continue to fool so many with that myth, long after he was dead and buried. They knew he was dead. Do not fall for their stories this time. Your enemies have access to knowledge that was once yours. They removed it from you and now use it against you. I have tried, so many times, to open your eyes to the fact that there are those amongst you, who, though they may appear to look like you, are not like you. They want the earth for themselves. Michael Sarian explains this on YouTube. Paris, Islam, Zionism, and the Red Papacy. Take this valuable information share it, and act on it. I have always said, nothing is as it seems. What is portrayed in your world as good, is totally evil. They plan many more attacks like the one in Paris. These are effective, as they give them permission to curtail your freedom of movement even further. When government is complicit in killing its own people, then good men need to stand together to expose such actions. Remember, they can only act with your consent, so indirectly, you too, have blood on your hands. The reports you see on television are pure fiction. They all give the same story, as they are all obeying the commands of the cabal. There is a move afoot to chip the US Army, to make complete robots of the soldiers. How dangerous that would be, as they could then be controlled by an artificial intelligence. They do not want humans on Earth. They want their new world order. They have manipulated your minds so that you see as normal, what they do to kill and maim you. The diseases now prevalent were commissioned by them, and released to destroy humanity, yet they constantly tell you that they protect you. How evil is that? You cannot afford to remain as silent, obedient slaves. You need to find your voice. That is all you need. Say loudly and clearly, I refuse to assist you to wipe out humanity and take our world from us. It is time that they return to the planet which they destroyed before they entered the Earth. They are not welcome on Earth. Tell them to take their false religions with them. They have destroyed all that was good and wholesome on the Earth. Wealth is what they live for. It drives them to do unspeakable things in order to acquire it. They do not have souls nor conscience, which leaves them free to kill and steal. Be grateful to those kind souls who take the time to meditate on the ley lines and sacred places, to release the sacred energy which will enable mankind to have the strength to remove all that is evil and corrupt. People are beginning to tell the truth. Two journalists, one Irish, and one German, have refused to comply with the lies anymore. They have exposed the truth. Pray that many more journalists will follow their example. This is when you know that you have got through to the masses. Do not allow the false flags and other atrocities which the cabal uses, to create fear in you, as this is exactly what they want. Many have chosen to sacrifice themselves in order to protect humanity and the earth. Your enemies are many. They use many guises to hide their ill intent, religion, banking, and politics. But you, my friends, are the 99%. Without you, they are nothing.
listen to those who explain the truth. Those who go back in history to a time when they came onto the earth and took control. Once you understand, then, and only then, will you get the full picture. Together, you can stop the killing and all the needless wars that serve to destroy humanity and your heritage. Think about it. Talk about it. Act on it. It's in your hands. My dear, you are right. Those little laser lights that flash on you are a form of attack. They are losing their grip. This leads to mistakes. Be on your guard. Concentrate on gaining freedom for the one. It may not seem like it, but the light is extending. It is removing the influence of the dark. Take good care of yourself, as you have work to do. Always, you're adoring, Monty. Channeled by Veronica Keen. MontagueKeen.com